The videos you are about to see are beyond insane and they get even better towards the end with a big finale of sense. Sam Reynolds got superpowers, Adrian Laurent is able to fly as well and the pink bike guys need a lawyer again. This is a hard case, you better hire a really good one. Matt McDuff with a gnarly bar spin in the streets while G. Atherton rides a ridge line as usual. Adrian Laurent does some proper free riding and let me remind you the really crazy ones are still ahead of us. What a beautiful landscape, I wish I could magically spawn trail features just like Sam Reynolds. This is one of the coolest and most creative videos I have ever seen. Shimano granted Sam some superpowers and he puts them to good use. A complete contrast in video style pink bike with the sunday saves nine and these are all clips where the riders barely made it a fear that adrian laurent does not have because he is an animal for juice zero we need the special forces on the ground and in the air make it quick don't make any noise and be sure to capture the objective roll the ground teams Commensal world with a full-blown military-grade mission, the guys are all in black in the air and on the ground. But just because it's a stealth mission doesn't mean it can't be a cinematic masterpiece. The guys are throwing tricks left and right, even a superman like Sam. What is going on? 69420, we're close to the target. Ground Team 1 has visual. Dude, after all that stress, I'm going to watch Luke on YouTube. From Commensal to Mongoose Bikes, go down and let me know what bike you ride. Speaking of going down, Ian Bodor with yet another free ride piece. And all that while Shimano is throwing the sickest CGI in our direction. Whoever was in charge of the edit is a god on the machine just like these two guys. And now to a new video for today, Will Hines is destroying a bike park. Exceptional drone shots, incredible use of our good old son. Yet another A grade edit. And now a little puzzle, who is going? Going to mess up this beautiful train. Of course, it's the last guy. We all have that one friend sent this video to him. Matt McDuff with a ninja drop, one of the coolest street edits that blessed my eyes. This guy is of course very talented as we know. Just like Nico Vink. From the streets to the green, this time Transition Bikes is responsible for the safety hazard. And now back to G. Atherton with his unbelievable video, The Knife Edge. This one has the gnarliest crash ever in it. Of course I cannot show it on YouTube. Check out his video or my best fails ever series on Patreon. From a legend of the game to a newcomer, 92 subscribers only as of right now and I love pushing young talent. And I'm not talking about YT Industries, Reedbox is riding the Cam Sync Invitational at first I thought it was Darkfest. And if you are thinking that this is a great airtime, you are right. But you will be shocked how high people will go in this video. But before that, we have to highlight the artistic approach Nico Vink with beautiful nature shots. We mountain bikers are men of culture, this is not just a video game. Man, it's so hard to decide which bike do I choose. I think I'm going 29er on this one. Okay, calm down, no sweaty hands, we got this. What a freaking cool idea this video has. Canyon Bicycles, you really did a great job there. Let me play another round. Okay, I'm ready for multiplayer. Let's go mixed wheels. Schladming, Utah. Finale. Let's go Schladming. Okay, breathe. Dude, I suck at this game. But fortunately, the canyon guys don't. One is even playing in first person mode and they are racking up points. Tuck no hander a thousand. Sick whip 500. And all these videos are better than anything Hollywood has ever released. And the cleaning services Sam Reynolds offer are better than some trail crews out there. Take note, bike park owners. Huge send from Nico into a new video for today, Matchstick Productions, Carson Storch and Jesse East. And one quick change of skin color later, we are ready for Paul Genovese's insane superman seat grab one more time in slow motion please. And if you are thinking this is the big air I was talking about, it will get much higher than this. But first, Buzz van Steenbergen wants to be in the pink bike video as well, the sky is vaping and this guy is hitting one road gap after the 
next, we don't even have to cut there, because the next one is already coming up and that is because this is designed by himself, this is his property. So if you want the sickest tour of his home trails and a couple great routes, you know where to find this talented guy. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Adrian Laurent is back home in Les Deux Alpes and I have no idea if I butchered the pronunciation. All I know is that Sam can spawn trees for tire taps. This is the gardener we all deserve. Nico Vink seems to be racing the drone, what a cool slow motion shot. And you gotta love this suspension, looks so sick and I hope Reed Box has a good suspension for that 360 landing. Huge POV jumps and even a nice little, or maybe not so little, seat grab there. While the matchstick guys are flying through the air together, you can even see the drone on the right side, perfect camera work. Going through the chairlift and a double roost, this is so cool. Now to another gnarly shot, Adrian sends it between two trees and then goes big. These professionals are all way too good, they almost make me sick. Thank you Adrian for cooling us off as we are going into the noob section. Don't come here if it's wet or foggy, if you're not really really good. I'm having much trouble and it's definitely dangerous. Now we're going into a slightly different terrain here. I do like it. Whoa, wet routes, very oh, difficult. Man, what would I give to be able to free ride like Gamma Corbera? We are introducing some more crazy videos before the grand finale. Darko with a very cool edit. I love the red Kona bike. Such vibrant colors, what a pleasure to watch. And now we are slowly getting ready for the last insane clips. Matchstick Productions on the wooden berm into a big free ride descent on this rocky mountain. And now I feel like it's time for a sick backflip Gamma Corbera thank you very much for that one so much style she is even touching the tire in the middle of the air and Ian Bodor is sending quite literally a road gap this dude is completely in control and I'm not sure about Adrian swerving left and right with a bird's eye view camera that's so cool and a massive send the next to last clip is already mind blowing but the last one Clemens Caudela and Swatch Nines watch his mental battle before doing that feature really interesting make sure to subscribe to all the people you saw today all right shop run downhill i am here this track is called speed x2 i'm here with my friend snow and we are trying to have some fun on this trail and i think oh shit i got mud in my mouth 